are all wires created equal? I guarantee you, after watching today's show, you're going to think twice about that statement. Today, we're talking about a brand that is literally built on innovation and solutions based on feedback from dealers, which also offer some pretty unique characteristics that we're going to find out about today in detail. We've got Terry Letney in the studio for, with us today, giving us all the breakdown of wires in the accessory category. This is CMA Connected, brought to you by SiriusXM, Wires, and it starts now. What's going on, everybody? Welcome to another CMA Connected brought to you by SiriusXM. I'm your host, Ben Wu. And as we surf through the field of so many different products in the accessory category, we've landed on a very unique one. One that I can say I'm pretty proud to say is also Canadian based. We're talking about Wires, a brand that has really brought some incredible solutions in the field of wiring, interconnects, distribution blocks, and much more. As promised, we've got Terry Letney, their president and owner, in the studio with us today. So, Terry, let me ask you, what type of things will we be discussing on today's segment? Hey, Ben, thank you. I'm really excited to be here with you today. Um, some of the things that I'd like to talk to you about is the amp kits, bulk rolls of wire, primary wire, some of our distribution blocks and their unique characteristics, our sound deadening, we have woofer enclosures, and much more. We're really excited. Thank you. Sounds like we've got a lot of boxes to check and categories to cover on today's show. But before we do that, a quick opportunity for our partner SiriusXM to remind you dealers out there why you should love it. And when we come back, we are going category for category with Terry Letney and Wires. Hey guys, Ricky Lima here from SiriusXM. I had a chance to speak to some dealers and ask them what they love about selling SiriusXM. Here's what they had to say. Coast to coast coverage. I love SiriusXM for commercial free music. It's a great add on sale and a profit opportunity. We love selling Sirius XM because you can listen to the same channel coast to coast. Profitability and ease of installation. It's a no brainer. We love selling Sirius XM for its ease of installation, great profitability, and its reliability. People love it. All right, welcome back, everybody. Let's get into it. We've got Terry Letney with us. And we're going to walk through the entire catalog that Wires is, starting with probably one of the most important categories, ones that you guys out there are probably sell the most. And of course, we're talking about amplifier kits or amp kits. And Terry, from my understanding, there's different levels offered within the amp kits. Can you walk us through exactly what the differences are and the different packaging that they come with? Absolutely, Ben. We have, with Wires, we have four different series. So what we're going to show you first is our power series. It's denoted with the red coloring. Our amp kits are complete. They come with speaker wire, they come with RCA, they come with power and ground. We have um, everything that you need all in one box. And this here is our power series. When you move on to the next step up, we have our tech series. Phil has opened one up so we can show you the contents and how complete these kits are. Our tech series is also CCA, but it's a very high quality CCA. One, some of the things that make us different, the fuse holder that has Phil has, it has six-way water protection. So you notice that on each end, there's three gaskets. Again, everything Wires does is solid brass. All the set screws are steel. So this makes for a much more reliable connection to the fuse holder. When you look at the RCA, it's our twisted pair RCA in the tech series. And one of the other cool things that we do is our speak, our power wire is already pre-crimped. So you'll see that the ring terminals are crimped at the factory. So your installer doesn't have to go looking for the crimp tool. So this is our, that's one step that's already done for you. Um, you'll notice too, this the remote turn on wire, we have blue with a white stripe. We're the only company that I'm aware of at this time that has remote turn on wire that's not solid blue. This kit is complete. It comes with a bag of accessories, loom, everything you need to do an install, even down to the wire sticker that's included with every one of our amp kits. Moving on from there, we go to the Tech Plus series. Now this is the, has the same complete co contents as the Tech series and the Power series, except this kit is a pure copper solution. Again, it has the speed wire, RCA, everything you need to do the installation, the bag of bits, 
and the wire sticker. Everything is there and it's a pure copper kit. Moving on from there, we go to our signature series. Our signature series are power flow only. They do not include RCA and do not include speaker wire. This is great in cars where you're going to be doing a line output converters and not going to be needing an RCA. Plus, it's our premium wire, the pure copper signature wire. You'll notice that all of our amp kits have the same size and shape. The different series are denoted with the different colors. Some really sharp looking amp kits there, Terry. And uh, I mean, from a packaging standpoint, what, what can you ask for more? Very, very well thought out, well executed. Now, through the grapevine, obviously, I do talk to a lot of installers out there. And one thing that I know for sure that installers are, um, they, they absolutely love and appreciate is when it comes to the bulk wire offering from wire. So why don't you walk us through why that is and what are some of the unique features that your bulk wire offers that maybe some of your competitors don't? Thanks, Ben. Yeah, with wires, we have four series of uh, power bulk rolls of wire as well. So we have our power series, we have TAC, we have TAC Plus, and we have Signature. Um, we have them available in multiple gauges. We have zero gauge, four gauge, and eight gauge. We have red, blue, and black. Um, on our zero gauge, we do something quite unique. Our power, so our red and uh, blue and zero gauge are in 50 foot rolls. The, I, the thought process behind that is that you need approximately 17 feet of power wire per car. So that works out to three cars. On our ground, most shops don't go through anywhere near as much in the block. So we make our zero gauge ground a 25 foot roll. Um, helps with the efficiencies within the shop bay. Um, we have EIA color speaker wire. Really cool with the installers. We have the 16 gauge with 20 gauge um, uh, RGB wiring for marine applications where you have the lights built into the, the, the speakers. So you have two 16 gauge speaker wires and four 20 gauge uh, RGB wires. We have obviously the nine wire speed wire uh, with the remote turn on with the AEIA, EIA color standard um, speaker wires within it. Here we're going to get Phil to do a demo. Um, he's going to show you how the wire spins. The wire in his hand currently is wire that he spun a couple days ago, which really, truly impressed him on how it uh, not just spun, but stayed spun. So he's going to do a live demo here with his uh, DeWalt. Unfortunately, he doesn't have a Milwaukee, but uh, hey, we won't hold that against him. So here he goes. So you'll notice that once he releases it, it stays spun. Makes your, you don't have to use up a whole roll of tape to uh, make it get that effect. This wire was created with probably nine months worth of research to get this wire to the way we want it to hold this shape the way it does there. And yeah, Phil, if you could just twist, show them, like just twist the, like one of the wires by hand there and show them. Yeah, they just stay in the position. With wires, we have such a wide array of power wire, ground wire, speed wire, speed wire, EIA color wire, and you saw with the demo with the primary wire, we have you covered. Very impressive characteristics and selection, Mr. Letney, when it comes to your bulk wire, no doubt about it. I've seen that trick before, and it continues to be something that hits home. And you deal, you installers know what I'm talking about. It just makes for that clean installation, especially when you have a bunch of different colors going on. And then you can wrap that, and I'm sure we're going to get into other materials that are going to help with that job as well. Now, moving on to our next category, a very important category, especially when it comes to the sound quality of everything. Uh, we're talking about the interconnects, because you know this is what connects your source unit um, to your amplifier. So what solutions does wires offer when it comes to interconnects. With wires, we have two series of RCA interconnects. We have our tech series, and we have our signature series. The tech series looks like a lot of the other RCAs that you may see on the market. However, internally, they are different. We have technology built into our RCAs that make ours superior at sound quality and noise rejection. As an example, within the blue RCA, which is a tech series, we have a third conductor. That third conductor is non-insulated and runs the entire length of the RCA. It shorts out along the metal uh, nylon metalized foil. And what that does is it helps to ground out and reduce, reject all noises. To help increase the reliability of the RCA, we have a split tip and a, uh, so the signal part of the RCA is actually split and flanged out. And then the crimped part where the ground is, it's crimped. And it when you plug it into the amplifier or into the 
uh, head unit, it makes for a very secure, reliable connection. In following with the family look, you'll notice the RCA on the right side is our tax series, finished with the blue highlights. We have these RCAs available in both Y adapters. We have one foot, one and a half foot, three, six, nine, 12, 17, 17, two channel, 17, four channel. The 17 foot two channel is also available in bulk where you, since it's such a popular RCA for us, it allows you to have a little bit of a cost savings and less garbage to throw out. We also have it in a 25 foot. The RCA on the left is our signature series and denoted with the gray accents. Um, these RCAs available, both Y adapters, three foot, six foot, nine, 12, 17, 17 foot, four channel, and a 20 foot, two channel. With our signature RCAs, you get a couple of extra features and benefits over the tech series to make it even better at noise rejection. Some of those features, we have the uh, left side of the RCA and the right side are individually shielded. And then after the nub where they join into one jacket, they're shielded again. The third uh, conductor inside of it is connected at both ends, giving you superior noise rejection. Um, from a reliability point of view, the split tip and the crimped ring, they, they will plug firmly onto the amplifier or onto the head unit. Again, all about reliability with wires. All right, moving on to our next category, and I believe this is another category that Wires has really found a, a following in because of the unique offering that they have for power management solutions. Uh, Terry, I know there's many different options within this category, so let's take our time and really break down the different um, items which exist within power management. Um, I'd just like to reiterate, everything we do at Wires is about reliability. So when we look at these solutions, um, some of the things they all have in common is they're all made out of solid brass. All the set screws and and uh, are made of steel. Um, again, it all plays to reliability. Everywhere where they have a fuse connection, it has fuse lock, which is that crush washer that uh, helps make that connection to the fuse very secure. They have grip tip, which makes the power wires entering and exiting the blocks all very secure. We have uh, in studio here, we have uh, a solutions that I'd like to review with you. We have uh, like our PFT48, which is the fuse holder at the bottom of the screen. Um, it's a mini NL fuse holder and you think, ah, fuse holder is a fuse holder, but with wires, it's not. So some of the things you'll notice is we have six way water protection. So there's three grommets on either side. Uh, many of our competitors only have two. So this helps just one more step at keeping water out of it. Um, you'll notice that, uh, the fuse lock where that, where the fuse connects and the grip tip on the set screws, these, all these things play into reliability. Um, another thing with our fuse holders is that they include a 60 amp fuse when you buy them in a uh, package. And you know, that fuses have a, a value and it all, it all adds to uh, the overall uh, for value, uh, the value of the product. Um, when you move into um, the fuse at the top left, that is a very unique solution. That is a mini a &L with a zero gauge in and out. So again, when you're working on some of these cars, it's hard to find a spot to put the full size a &L fuse holder this here is a way to, this is good for up to 200 amps and includes a 200 amp fuse. Again, with the six way water protection, um, it's a wonderful solution. Um, in the battery terminals, we have the one in the middle. That is a power and, uh, sorry, a fused battery uh, output. So you can run a zero gauge output right out of the fuse block. So there is no need to even have a fuse holder under the hood. And you can reduce it to four gauge as well. And then it has the connections for the factory uh, wiring, two, four uh, a four gauge and two eight gauge, comes with a Lexan cover. And you'll notice that that chunk where the zero gauge connects out of it, it has, we have a Lexan base and Lexan dividers so that there's no way for this to short out ever. If your vehicle is in an accident or anything, that Lexan will protect the, 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 the unit from shorting out on itself. We have the other battery terminal and if you flip it upside down, you'll notice it comes with a shim in it. That shim allows it to work on a 17 mil or 19 mil or also positive and negatives. So it has that family look. They, the power and the ground one both look the same, or you can use that one as a, a power and then use an external fuse, whatever makes the most sense for the install and the job at hand. When you look at the, the W block, um, that block, again, has power and ground all in, centralized in one hub. Very easy for uh, wire management making the job look good and uh, easy to access the fuses. Everything is there in one spot. When you look at the other distribution block there, that is our PDFS2. 
One of the things that we do at Wires is we never want to be the dead end in a system design. You'll notice there you have a zero gauge in plus a, a four gauge in. If a guy buys uh, two amplifiers, this is a perfect solution. But if down the road the guy decides to add another amplifier, you can just daisy chain off that four gauge or eight gauge or zero gauge input and add another fuse holder or another distribution block. So with this one, you're never at the end of the system design. And then we have the PDSL41. This is available both in power and ground. What we have here is a picture of the ground block, but they come with plastic bases to link them together. And then you have uh, bus bars that allow you to join. Basically, it's a do-it-yourself distribution block. If you could, with it, you can have a one in, one out. You can have one in, three out, four out, five out. You can have two in, three in, whatever you want. The, the options are unlimited with wires. We're going to take a quick detour off the copper and wire as well as power management solutions into another category that wires also offer solutions for. Yes, we're talking about enclosures for subwoofers and base. Terry, what kind of offering do you currently have uh, in the catalog when it comes to enclosures? With wires, we have eight different models of woofer enclosures. We have 110 sealed and ported, 112 sealed and ported, 210 sealed and ported and 212 sealed and ported. We also have six by nine boxes, which we're not gonna talk about today, but we're gonna, what I wanna do is dive in on the features and benefits of the woofer enclosures. So what we're looking at here is the internal uh, picture of the 10 inch ported box. You'll notice that the port is braced at both ends. So again, with everything we do, we want everything to be reliable. The construction of the box, it, the body is three quarter inch furniture grade MDF and the baffle is one inch MDF. Um, reason we talk about furniture grade, this wood is really hard. Um, if you uh, don't pre-drill the screw holes, you might break a screw. These, th this wood is tough. What you're seeing now is the inlaid carpet seams and the radius port. This is uh, done to reduce port noise. You'll also notice that the back of the box is on an angle. This is uh, for two purposes. When you slide it into the trunk, that'll fit up to the back of the rear seat with a minimal amount of wasted space. But more importantly, that angle uh, reduces standing waves within the enclosure, which makes it more uh, efficient. Um, we have um, rabbit dado construction. The way that is built, basically when you have a butt joint, you have 90 degrees of surface contact, whereas with a rabbit dado, you get 270 degrees. We glue it and then uh, nail it as well. These boxes are really well built. But the most important feature of these boxes is the internal volume. That 10 inch box has 1.2 cubic feet of net internal volume. This box is built for the subwoofers you sell. When I say you, what you sell, it's basically all 10 inch woofers want the volume 1.2 cubic feet in a ported enclosure. Our 12 inch, same features, same everything, except 1.75 cubic feet net. Uh, when you get into the dual 10 or the dual 12, exact same thing, but double the size. Our sealed boxes have the same technology, obviously without the port. And our sealed 10 is 0.6 and our sealed 12 is 1.2 cubic feet net. The slide you're looking at now basically re just basically reiterates everything that we just talked about. It talks about the internal volume, the tuning frequency of the enclosures, uh, the way that the boxes are built and the features and benefits of the boxes. The feedback we've had from these boxes in the field is that when using these boxes over a lot of the other boxes that are out there, these give you more output, plainly, simply said. And last but not least, we've kind of saved this category because it is a new addition to the offering from Wires, but a very important one. And you installers out there will certainly appreciate when we discuss the tape offering from Wires. So Wires recently added... Uh, cloth tape to our offering. We have uh, four models. We have two interior models and two exterior models. The interior ones are your OEM grade uh, cloth tape, ideal for uh, making your look, your installs look factory OEM. Um, basically, when you look under the dash of a vehicle, what a lot of technicians want is for their work to look OEM or stock. With our tape, we have it avail the interior available in three quarter inch width and three eighths width. The three eighths width is good for if you're just trying to keep wires bundled. The three quarter is if you want to have complete coverage, more much like the OEM with under a dash. When you're with the exterior product, it's made to have a higher heat rating. Um, actually, you can't even rip the stuff. Well, maybe some of the viewers can rip it. I can't. Um, you have to when you cut it. You have to use a knife. 
Um, the exterior one has a very high temperature rating. It's great for an engine compartment. Um, it, it'll uh, reject water. Um, again, it, this is about making your installs look OEM. When you're running wires under the hood or in, under the dash, you want it, the install to look as OEM as possible. And that's what the benefit of this wire is, especially right now as we approach the remote circuit season. So here we have uh, in studio some of the tape. So the ones on the left are the interior tapes. And I'll get Phil to just pull off a piece and rip it and show you. So that's the three quarter inch, obviously, one there. And Phil can rip it right there. Little demo for us. And then the three, three eighths tape, the other interior tape, basically exact same product, just it's a thinner tape. And it's good if you're going to do like a one inch spacing down the wire. Obviously the tape is sticky. <laughs> and then Phil can do a little demo with it on the primary wire for us. And there's your two different kind of applications. Then the other two rolls are the exterior tape. Phil, can you please rip that for us? One of your choice. I'm just kidding, you can't rip it. You might need cutters to rip that or cut it. But this is the tape that's made for the engine compartment and any external. <laughs> You're not going to be able to get that one rip, buddy. Yeah. And there you have it. The new wires cloth tape. All right. That was wires. Terry Letney in the studio with us today, walking us through the entire offering that wires has to offer. Now, if you're interested to get more details on any of the products covered on today's session, I do encourage you to check out their website on the screen right now. And if you're a Canadian dealer, then you should know that the official exclusive distributor for all things wires within Canada is, of course, Automobility. Had to reach out to my boy, Phil Cameron, to get his input on how he feels about this wires product. Now, Phil, I understand you've had the chance to play with some of these um, wires and accessories and maybe the tape on your own vehicle. So let's hear from you how you thought these products performed. As you mentioned, I've been working on my car lately and I just ran some wiring for power. So battery to the back to my amplifier uh, fuse block. And I used a zero gauge, not because I really need a zero gauge, just because I can use a zero gauge. And wires was my wiring of choice. And I have to say one thing, this wiring is extremely flexible and you can twist and bend it, tie a knot, do whatever you want. It made the install a lot easier. If you've ever ran a zero gauge wire in a car, it's not easy to run because it's big, right? But this made it a lot easier to work with, a lot easier to maneuver, to bend it. So it made the install a lot easy for me on that part. Second thing that I used was the tape, right? Most of us tech are very proud of our installation, even if you're not going to see anything. So wiring is one of them. I use the interior tape a lot, and I also use the exterior tape a lot. So even the smallest of the details will matter in insulation. And this is pretty cool that you can get this directly from automobility and wires and the two different size for both exterior and interior. This is going to make your life easy for your installation tools. That's pretty hardcore, Phil. I got to admit it. Zero gauge. I don't think I've ever put in zero gauge. So it's good for you. Um, now, based on this presentation, you know, Terry really showed a lot of different, very unique products. I want your take on some of these products he presented and how you feel that installers, um, from your experience, could certainly take advantage of uh, some of these products. Well, a couple of things will set it apart. Uh, Let's keep on with the trend of wiring. This guy being able to twist and turn it and it will remain twisted. This is a very unique feature. I like this. I like to twist my stuff. So it makes it a lot easier. And one of the things I like is the uh, modular fuse block. Like you never know what you're going to do with your system. If you're going to expand and having the ability to create your own, if you want two way, three way, four way, having that ability set with this product makes it a lot, a lot more flexible than having to pick one product that only has two outputs. I really enjoy this. This is pretty cool. I want to take this opportunity and thank my guests for coming on today, both Terry Letney from Wires as well as Phil Cameron from Automobility. 
And in my closing comments, when it comes to accessories, you know, it's a personal choice. There's a lot of factors that are going to affect your decision making as a shop to partner up with the right brand. Based on the presentation today, Wire certainly does have a couple interesting features that are worth noting. The very first thing is the packaging. I, I love the fact that they've given a lot of thought into the way it packages, the way it looks and feels to your customers, and more importantly, how it optimizes the very, very valuable space that you have on your slot wall. The second thing is those custom characteristics that I feel Wires has really stepped up on, especially with the multiple color offering in the primary wire, the memory capability of some of that wire as you saw in the demonstration, and all these interesting things and solutions such as the W power block that incorporates both the ground and power. All this to say is that this is truly a brand that has given thought and has applied you know, specific design elements based on what installers need. And for me, that's important to note because that feels like it's a true partnership in the making. That's it for this CMA Connected brought to you by SiriusXM. I'm your host, Ben Wu. Until next time, we connect. There's never been a better time to have Sirius XM with over 150 channels in your vehicle. Your Platinum Plan offer includes more than ever before to enjoy online, on your phone, or at home. Create your own ad-free personalized stations powered by Pandora. Hear ad-free extra channels and enjoy favorite shows with Sirius XM video on demand. What you love is on now.